question. If you've ever worn a bikini, you can definitely relate to Jean. Hi, doctors. How can I avoid salt burns after shaving down there? As soon as I hit the ocean, it burns. And don't get me started on the red bumps. It's just too much to upkeep. How can I avoid bikini burns and bumps this summer? There has got to be a better way. Ooh, salt on a raw bikini. Oh, that burns and stings. Oh my God. Oh, so right, ladies? Well, there's a solution. So we have Jean backstage in our procedure room with dermatologist Dr. Ava Shambam. How's it going back there, ladies? Great. It's, it's great. So shaving and waxing is so 1994. In 2011, what we do is laser and light-based hair removal, like this Palomar device, mm. to permanently reduce hair. Well, I think we should show everybody out there how, how the laser works. We have an animation to show that. What it is, the laser emits a specific wavelength of light. That light attracts to a certain chromophore, which is a pigment. The pigments in the hair shaft and the hair follicle. It actually disintegrates those part of the hair shaft the hair therefore dies. You may have to repeat the treatment. But the big pluses here are that there's a, a built-in cooling to the laser system. Nowadays, as Dr. Shaman said, it's much better than the old days. A wider pattern, it can get done quicker, doesn't hurt less likely to burn you. It, so before, it so bef is that really what you're saying? Yeah, that's yes. right, because you're a liar. No. <laughs> well, the big, I mean, it does. It does. It, I, not only, I, what are you talking about? I've, I've had my back lasered. It's agony. Not no, with the new systems. No, so these it's new not. lasers don't hurt? So this no, is a new no, laser. No. Laser. It's like taking a curling iron no. to your nether region. <laughs> it hurts towards the end. I'm not going to kid you. I don't think, well, I don't think know, Jillian I mean, is getting no, convinced, but, no, but it can be. No, but it's so worth it. No. Let me just say, and it's even so if it worth the it. the skin, doesn't it a little bit make the it's skin so just worth as it. soft as it yes. can be? Yeah. And it's it better than waxing. It's better than waxing. It's better than electrolysis. There's no ingrown hairs. There's no razor I thought you were passionate about weight loss, but you are so much more passionate about laser hair removal. Yeah, like I am. I'm like a furball. I'm like a waxing, furball? plucking, laser machine. <laughs> we got a furball yeah. here, Doc. Furball yeah. with a Jillian. So, Dr. Shamban, any do's and don'ts? Who's the <laughs> ideal patient other than Jillian? First of all, you want to look for the ideal health care provider to do your laser hair removal. Someone who's aware of the skin type and the skin tone that you have so that they can choose the proper device for your hair color and your skin so that you don't get a burn. The other important thing is after you have the treatment, don't go out and lay in the sun because you risk getting pigmentation. And the swimming, of course, wait a couple days for that too. And Jillian, come in any time. I promise it'll be painless I'll for like you. To forget, I like to, for, I like to <laughs> block that out. You know what? I have an example of full bonsai. So before you would have this full bonsai, after about um, three to six treatments, you'd have this sort of midway. This looks pitiful here, doesn't it? <laughs> but, uh, after that, about seven to ten weeks, you would have this sparse little shrubs going on. But again, you can design your own bonsai down there. <laughs> So it doesn't have yeah, to that... look like a, a Charlie Brown Christmas tree. <laughs> Point is, this is going to look a lot better on a human. Yes. So, so Jean, have you had the laser yet back there? How did it feel for you? It was fine. I had a little bit. It was, it was fine. It wasn't that bad. No. So, no, no, so basically, no Jean is tougher than Jillian. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Jillian, you know, come on back. Step. We're going to make sure that you have this latest, greatest technology. We're going to have you come back on the show and tell us whether or not it's it hurt. Not bad. <laughs> so it, it's not bad until like the last 15 seconds of the minute. It's so yeah, we're not changing your opinion. All right, never mind. Yeah. It, it's <laughs> it's Dr. Shaman, Jean, thank you so very much.